And my final port of call for the day is Taunton, and this is the Royal Bath and West Chase, or the Royal Bath and West Chase, depending on where you come from. High Town is the top one for Darren Thompson. Greek Kingdom for Paul Rhodes has also got Fiorentis Diamond. Admiral Ascoli for Martin Leedham. Evilith Carter for James Shea. Cashback David Hooley. Maslak Gacho for James Shea. Tin Pot Boris for Graham Clutterbuck. And Mao Picker for Daniel French. So nine of them this time in. Down in old Somerset, and away they go. And racing down towards the first in the road. It's a big old ditch, this one, and they all get over it safely, apart from Maslak Gacho, who didn't, and is out of the race straight away. So it's a short run to the second, which they're all safely over, and the great Tim Pot Boris is in the lead, although Mao Picker is pulling for its head. Cashback is in the purple jacket in third. The second of the greys in the purple and white stripes. Admiral Ascoli has been driven up the inside and Greek Kingdom's gone there. So we've lost two already then. And we've only been over three fences so far. So the field is down to just seven. And it's Evelith Carter who's now come through to take it up. So Evelith Carter is the leader from Cashback on the outside of the two greys. Tim Pot Boris and Admiral Ascoli. Then comes High Town in the white sleeves with white on the track. Fiorentis Diamond, the only remaining Paul Rhodes runner, as they get over the fourth and the back marker there is Mount Picker for Daniel French. So racing downhill then now towards the fifth. And there's only a short run. And this time it's Admiral Ascoli that's gone. So what is going on here? And they're falling like nobody's business. And that's three out already. And down to the sixth and the leader did a <laughs> It is best to try and be the next one to go then as well. So even if Carter, he's probably a mare to be honest, is the is the leader, was the leader, has now been headed by Tim Bot Boris who's still pulling for his head. So this is a rather bizarre race as they come past the winning post and you know we often see horses pulling for the head like that halfway through the race. But now Mad Picker has come through with fear into his diamond to share the lead. So I think just about everybody, with the exception of High Town has been in the lead, but they're uh, racing there towards the final mile. And Evelith Carter is in front from Fiorentis Diamond in second. Then comes Tin Pot Boris and Mayor Picker with High Town on the outside. And Cashback is having a turn at the back as they come to number seven. And over that one they go, they all jump that one. All right, with Evelith Carter the leader. There's three early fallers. But it's Evelith Carter then. So just lost them behind the trees there for a second. But Evelith Carter's in the lead now. High Town is coming around the outside. Tim Pot Boris is next. Mad Picker in the centre of the track as they get over that one on the centre of the track, the centre of the group. But it's Evelith Carter who's in front from High Town and Fiorentis Diamond as they get over number nine. And you wouldn't rule any of these out at this point. Cash back the back markers, no more than four lengths off the lead, and it's Evelith Carter who is in that lead as they come down to this next ditch. That's number 10, and they all get over that one nicely. And the field really beginning to bunch now as High Town comes up on the outside of Evelith Carter. Mao Picker between the two, then Fiorentis Diamond, Tim Pot, Boris, and Cashback. It's almost three and a line and three and a line behind them as they begin to swing now towards the final three furlongs in the race and it's just Evelith Carter on the inside who's just about in the lead from Mao Picker and High Town and Fiorentis Diamond it's coming down there towards his third last and over that one it was Mao Picker that landed in the lead Mao Picker's in front from High Town and Evelith Carter cash back running on over the second last they go mistake by Fiorentis Diamond that might pull that one out of it but Mao Picker's gone on Mao Picker then racing down towards the final fence Mao Picker from High Town then cash back over the final fence they go Mao Picker lands in front High Town in second and then cash back and Evelith Carter trying to run on, but it's Mao Picker inside the final half wheel off. And Mao Picker looks like he's going to hold on and race it up towards the line. It's going to be Mao Picker. Going to take it, Mao Picker. They're going to hit Bob for a second between High Town and Cashback. And a really dramatic race early on with three fours. And Mao Picker got it pretty cosily, really. And neither of the Chasing pair ever really looked like getting to him, and it's Mount Picker for Daniel French, the winner. High Town for Darren Thompson was second. Cashback for David Hooley was third, and Evelith Carter for James Shea was fourth, and Fiorentis Diamond was fifth.